my name is Marlies. Welcome to Morning Breathwork. Thank you so much for choosing to be here with me this morning. We will wake up together. This practice is going to bring you lots of energy, but with a sense of groundedness within your body. So please go ahead and close your eyes for a moment. Let's take a few breaths together to get started. Take a big inhale through the nose, from your belly all the way to your chest. And a little audible sigh, exhale. And feel that exhale ground you just a little deeper into this moment. Let's do that again. Take a big breath in through the nose, please. And out of your mouth, exhale. So let's take one more breath together. Take a big inhale through the nose, please. Make this one the biggest one of the morning. Fill it all the way to the top. Hold your breath. Maybe sip in a little extra air. And an audible little sigh. Beautiful. Now please go ahead and find a comfortable position for you to sit, but lean against something, perhaps a wall or a couch or something. So I want you upright, but relax at the same time. Once you find your seat, please go ahead and close your eyes. When you begin to close your eyes, you know you have an opportunity to begin to tune in with yourself and stepping away from everything and everything on the outside. So in a moment, we are gonna take 30 really strong breaths. It's gonna be a strong inhale through the nose. Your chest is gonna lift to get that big inhale in. One strong exhale through the mouth, squeezing your ribs down, down, down towards your spine, like you wanna squeeze every single drop of that exhale out. And we're gonna do 30 of those. Make them strong, make them big. And just a side note, you might feel tingles and vibrations, maybe temperature shifts moving through the body, you can get a little hotter as well, as this practice is gonna invigorate and wake up your energetic body. Are you ready? Let's do it. Join in, I will do 30 with you, okay? And just do the best you can. Here we go. We're five in. We're 10 in. I'm already feeling it. We're halfway, keep going. Last 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, keep going, four, three, two, take an inhale, take an exhale and stay empty. So squeeze that exhale out and don't take an inhale, just hold. So if you're like you're squeezing your belly, it's almost like that root chakra, that energy center has so much energy, it actually gives birth, right? So if you're like you're squeezing that part of your body, almost like you're holding your pee, it's the best way to describe it. And then in a moment, we're gonna take an inhale and hold that breath too. So take an inhale, pull that energy all the way up. Just imagine you do, all the way to your chest and hold this inhale now. And within this inhale, I want you to just try to relax your physical body while you're holding this breath and just trust. Your mind's probably not gonna like this process. It doesn't really understand the concept of meditation, but let's do it anyway. So in a moment, we're gonna do the whole thing all over again. I might not do every single breath with you, but I'm gonna count with you. You ready? Okay, audible sigh, please. Here we go, 30 more. Keep going. Trust it. More energy. You're five in, keep going. Good. Seven, eight, nine, 
10, you're almost halfway. Last 15. Counting down to 10. Eight. Six. Four. Three. Two. Take a breath in. Take a breath out and stay empty. So don't take another inhale again. Just stay right there. Now you might feel sensations through the body and that's a good sign. Energy is beginning to wake up. Just trust it. Squeeze your lower belly and hold. You're doing great. All right, take an inhale all the way up to the upper chest and just hold that inhale. Feel full, but try to relax in that fullness of that breath. We call it prana, life force, energy, inspiration for your day. Hold just a little longer. It's okay if you're being a little uncomfortable. That's okay, you're so safe here. And side out. Keeping the eyes closed, but let go of that conscious active breath. And in this moment, I want you to drop into any and all sensations you might be feeling through your body. If you're not feeling any, anything, that's okay. Lots is happening. So keep relaxing into that space. Focus on what feels good in the body. And so what we're doing is we're just taking a moment and dropping from the mind all the way down into the body. And the breath is an opportunity for us to kind of ignite and wake us up real fast. All the good things, while the mind begins to quiet, even though the mind is not that awake yet, and that's great. And so while you're dropping into this moment, I want to ask you, how would you like to feel through your day today? What kind of heightened or positive feeling would you like to feel throughout the day? And I'll give you an example. Joy, happiness, openness, love, maybe a sense of freedom, feeling of in love, or safety. And all of the above, right? Let's go ahead and pick like one feeling that you would like to feel throughout your day. And if you have ever felt it in your life somewhere, you can bring it back. It's a memory. You're even welcome to go back to that time and that memory when you felt it for a moment. You can kind of drift back in time for a moment. And just drop into that feeling. And what is that feeling? What does it feel like in your body right now? Is it lightness? Expansion? Sense of freedom? And I know it's really hard to kind of put a word to the feeling sometimes, and we don't even have to, but just follow sensation. And just imagine that that feeling is happening again in your body right now, for real. And in a way, you can build a memory of that feeling. If you felt it, you can choose to feel it again. And now from this place, I want you to imagine going out into the world today, feeling this way. Imagine you get into your car and you drive to work, still feeling this way. Imagine you are interacting with people around you at work, still feeling this way. And what does that feel like? And who do you become through feeling this way today? Do you stand differently? 
do you hold yourself differently? And what choices do you make that's different compared to yesterday? How do you communicate? And how do you feel in your body? It's really fun to be able to rehearse this because the more we do, the more familiar it becomes and the more we become it. And so really take this moment and just moving through your day in your mind feeling this way. And then allow yourself to build a memory of that feeling. What does it feel like in every single cell of your body right now? And the more you feel these feelings right in this moment in your body, the more you can own it. I'm gonna give you another two or maybe three rounds of breath here. Drop even deeper into this feeling. And then just know that when I start to bring you back into this reality, into wherever you are sitting in right in this moment, that this feeling is still with you and do your best to still hold on to it. So take a slow breath in through your nose. And just a little exhale, let it be nice and gentle. And again, please take another breath in, maybe a little fuller, beginning to wake up your nervous system a little bit. And again, a little sigh. You can even begin to listen to the sounds you can hear around you in your space. It can bring you back into this moment. Perhaps even the shape your body is occupying. And then whenever you feel ready, you can begin to slowly blink your eyes open and take in your environment again. And there's no rush. But when you do, you might even notice that your space look or feel very different because, well, you're different. So what I love about this practice and why we specifically do it in the morning is we get to set the tone for our day. We get to choose how we want to feel before we go into the world. I know for myself, when I don't practice this way, life sometimes dictates how I should feel and I get thrown into certain experiences and I'm not really fully grounded within myself. And so it's just a memory and it's also for us to remember that we are such powerful humans that we can choose how we want to feel. And when you make that decision in the morning, you ground that into your life and into your body. This practice drop us down into a body and for most of us as humans, we live in our minds a lot. There's nothing wrong with the mind. But when we live in our minds so much, we disconnect from our body and our intuition and feeling empowered. When we disconnect from our body, we can't really choose. Things choose for us. And so when we are connected and grounded in our body, we get to choose. We have the power because we're actually in our body and how we want to feel and how we want to proceed. And so this practice helps us to ground, to stimulate your sympathetic nervous system that wakes up and resets your nervous system. And so it's being less reactive and it's less feeling controlled by life, but be more in control of life and yourself. And so I hope that you enjoyed this practice and remember that 
that memory is always living inside of you. And when you forget, you can always come back and do this practice again and again and again. Because as humans, we live in our minds and we do forget. And it's not wrong, it's not right or wrong. It just is. And every time we come back and remember, we grow and we expand. And it's almost like we regain another superpower in a way. And so it's okay to forget. And then it's also okay to remember. And it's nothing wrong with needing these little reminders sometimes. Thank you so much for spending time with me today. I really hope I get to see you again. Let's take one more collective breath together. Take a big breath in, please. Hold it right there at the top. Take a little extra breath in. And audible sigh. Beautiful, thank you so much.